Hello everybody, this is Zephyrianic and welcome back to Mount and Blade Warband. I'm outside Suno because there's a tournament here that I want to participate in. It's been a very long time since we've participated in a tournament, I feel. And just to shake things up a little bit from the whole, you know, go attack a city, go attack a, a town, go attack a castle sort of thing. I want to go into a tournament battle. Just to, like I said, just to put a bit more diversity in. I know we did a lot of tournament battles originally to start the series. And that's mostly out of necessity to gain funds than anything. Now it's partially just due to a very large amount of enjoyment in them. They are really fun to participate in, I must admit. Of course, I'm just going to run with my axe raised. This guy is the only one here that could really be a problem. I mean, most of blue. Okay. And the fact that I'm being swamped by blue. That's a... Oh, look! The, the green guy actually started helping me. Oh, great. See, if, if they attack at once like this, it's not really a problem. I lost a decent bit of health off of that, but I didn't lose enough to... Well, apparently I can't hit him with an axe. How did... I fail to understand how I managed to not get damaged by the guy with the lance there. And... Whoa, 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 whoa. That was my entire team gone somehow. Holy crap. I didn't fully expect that, I'll be honest. Well, I got the... Uh, <laughs> the catch-all on that, so I guess, I mean... Oh, great. Now I'm definitely not going to need the catch-all, because we're on... I'm on horseback with lances. I need to take out the other lancers first. Okay, that wasn't a lancer, but he's still dead. And anyone who's dead in this is still a good... A good thing. Okay, green is going down. I'm going to lance him, too. Or I'll just deal 96 damage to the horse and not even manage to kill the horse. Somehow. <laughs> just ran into him with a lance, and he's still alive. Okay. Well... He's dead now. <laughs> uh, I, I miss these tournaments. It's been so long since I've done one of these, to be honest. I've done... I haven't even done them in other files. I haven't really been playing this game off camera much. Hey, get out of the way, asswipe. There, right in the head. <laughs> That's what you get. I was talking to my blue dude over there, my teammate, because I thought he was going to run out in front, and I didn't want him... I mean, granted... <laughs> Shouting vulgarities at the video game is not going to change what the characters in the video game are and are not doing. And we won that, apparently, so maybe it does. Next round. Ooh, I'm on foot again. I'm going to stand behind the cavalry here. There we go. Use them as a bit of a shield. Partially out of necessity because I can't walk that quickly. I, you know, I could probably do with raising my athletics scale just slightly. That way I can at least get a little, be a little marginally bit faster. I'm really tempted to take this horse and I'm apparently swinging my axe. How did he block that? And where, is that Clefie? No, that's a sword sister. That explains why, yeah, that explains why we weren't managing to kill her. Because the short, sword sisters are incredibly powerful. I know Clefie's around here somewhere. <laughs> I saw her nameplate came up. All right, eight participants, two teams of two. Gotcha. Bet 500. And, ooh, I've got a Claymore. Which is good, because this is what I'm used to, is the two-handed weapons. That's where my proficiencies are higher. Oh, great, we lost my teammate. Just slashy time. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Why didn't why didn't my swing carry through? And stab. Okay, or just slash sideways and then dial. Oh, you're not going to... Okay, apparently the horse hit me. Which, uh, the, the horse did hit me. It just ran right into me. Go for the horse. Wait, I don't... Did I just break his ankle and knock him unconscious or something? Because that... <laughs> that did not hit him. That hit the horse. I swear it. Okay, who are the two that are left? Okay, there's... Well, the horse is down. And he somehow blocked that. Actually, that does make sense. Because if he was raising the shield up, then he would be able to block that. But that was a champion fighter. So, I wonder who, which one of them is going to win, because I doubt I'll be able to get over to this in time. Well, actually, one of them has a lance, so, yep. Okay, I gotta fight a sword sister in the final round. No, wait! This would be the fun. no, wait, one more is going to rise, because... Blocking the attack from behind. Great job, sword sister. Now, I'm going to probably end up fighting another sword sister. Yep, sword sister. Look, they're going to put her on a horse and put me on nothing. Oh, no, wait. Okay, this is even. We both have the same gear. I have a foot that apparently kicked her after I took damage, oddly enough. Just go aggressive. Don't worry about blocking. Okay, apparently worry about blocking. We each, I think we each just blocked those, either blocked or missed one another's attacks. 
There we go. Hey, you're dead. Well, you're not really dead. You're just unconscious. I'm gonna poke you. <laughs> I'm gonna poke you with the stick. And there's another 20 grand. Okay. I'm glad that we did that. I think there's another one up in tier as well. Mercy Swordsman, Ransom Broker. I like his I like his coat. Traveler, not gonna talk to you. And the only lord I have is Count Est. Oh look, there's actually steam that comes off there. That's cool. I mean it's not exactly realistic looking steam, but it's steam nonetheless. Hello, tavern keeper. Let's just buy everyone some ale. There we go. Or wine. I should leave. Now, I don't know if I have a dye works in in uh Suno or not. So let me see what the guild master and I don't because it didn't come out with the dye work thingy. By land. Alright. Uh from Velvet Silk and Dye. Four oh. Four hundred thirty one. That's lower than it normally is, but I'll still do it nonetheless. Lost ten grand. No, I don't want to meet the guild master again. There we go. Now I know there was one in way up in tier. Where is tier anyway? I think tier is no, apparently I'm wrong about all those. Wait. Where is Tyr? Tyr. Okay, there we go. Ah, we need to work our way up to there. If we can come across the battle on the way... Ooh. Oh, 30... That's only 33 of them. 33 of them would be a complete washout. A mayor on King Har... Oh my god. King Harless is one greedy bugger. Every time we've taken something, he's just... You know, giving it to himself. You better give me Morris. I'm gonna be upset if he doesn't. If he doesn't, I might def... I very well may defect to the... Uh, the Serenids. Actually, yeah, I think I would. I have nothing to lose, and I really, really want some territory. That, mostly that way I can rebel against them at some other point. But that is completely, completely, uh, uh, what, what am I trying to say? That doesn't matter whatsoever what I'm actually trying to accomplish. The footman. Yep, footman. Knights. I need, I need to turn that quest in, actually. I never did that. I think I said I was going to do that off camera and just never did that. Who do I even need doing this to? Marchand. It's the lord of, uh, Senu Senuzdaga Castle. That's definitely how you pronounce it. But, alright, I will bring those to him once we're done with this tournament that's in tier. Hopefully it's still there. If it's still there. Oh, good, it's still there. Let me take, investigate the market first. Ah, uh, balanced great sword. That's not that bad of a sword. It's really not. I mean, it's not nearly as great as the war cleaver I've got. There's very few things in this game that are as good as a war cleaver. Well, you could argue that fact, because you could very easily argue that the lances are better, simply because they have, you know, the couch. Hello, everybody. I am back. I am sorry about that. The game crashed, for whatever reason. 60 hours in this game, and I've never had a crash before. Now, anyway, I got, I beat the tournament again. I came back, and I repurchased whatever I purchased over there, the die works. I came back this year. I actually sold off Count Estoc, I believe it was. He was, they offered a trade, so I took the trade. We're going to hopefully not crash the game. By joining the tournament again. Go ahead. Let next round. Gonna crash? It didn't crash! Yay! The frames are really bad for whatever reason, but it didn't crash. Dealt damage. Okay, these archers need to go. Mostly that one particular one that's targeting me. Actually, they, they all are targeting me, it seems. Okay, I'll tank that damage. That's perfectly acceptable. That one, however, is not. Oh, that missed their head by such a small amount. I'm never gonna bother shooting that anymore. That would just be a complete mess if I were to shoot that, and I'd probably end up hitting one of my team members in the head, and I'd rather not do that. Never once killed my own teammate in this game. N uh, I mean, a friendly troop. I've hit them with arrows, but I've never actually killed them. Wait, move! Get out of the way! Why are you just standing there? I don't understand! Wait, why are they just standing there? Great. Yeah, come a little closer. Oh, yay! Wonderful. Okay. Uh, where's my dagger? There we go. Okay, I can spam the dagger. Like, repeatedly. <laughs> dagger spam! Away! Yeah, there's not much else I can do. You can't block with the dagger. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe that. Holy crap. I don't know why, but my arrows were not hitting any of the ones that were there. I think I missed by such small amounts that, you know, obviously I didn't hit because I didn't hit them. But it came very close to hitting them most of the time. However, it obviously, of course, like I said, did not. And that caused me to almost lose that. Thank God you can spam that dagger. And then, thank God these guys can't shoot. And a lot, you know, a line adjacent to them. 
Who is this, anyway? Hired Blade. Well, I'm not hiring you ever again if you lost that easily. Granted, I don't know why they gave you a bow. Hired Blades don't normally... I've never had a Hired Blade that used a bow before. Uh, who are you? You're in my party, aren't you? No, you're a sword... Si Wait. You look very, very similar to one of the members of my party, then. Is it incredibly close? Now, who's left? Uh, both the greens are left, actually. Wow, good for them. Well, okay, now... Both the yellows won. Wow, I'm I'm actually kind of surprised about that. I expect me to be one of the only ones left in that. Alright, this is a one-on-one, -on -one, it looks like. Yeah. Against yellow, I am red. You all... You look like Clethy. Are you Clethy? You're not Clethy. Your face isn't hard enough for that. You're a sword sister. Clethy is more of like a... A stern, jagged face than that, I suppose. All right, one of each. Who is it? Private sword says, "No, it's Zarina. Whoever that is." Oh look, she has the bow. No, oh my god, game. Hopefully, I can break the shield before she gets over here. That'd be awesome. Win because you break the shield. <laughs> or you get that close and then you take one to the head. Oh god, I'm sorry about that. I'm actually going to go to the Guildmaster and buy another Dye Works here, preferably. Uh, buy land for an empire. Oh, I already have a Dye Works. My bad. Do I have one up in, uh, in Suno? I w not Suno. Uh, whatchamacallit. Oh, great. Well, whatchamacallit is not a town I've ever heard of. No, I'm not going to talk to any of you. Maybe there's another hero character upstairs. But it's, uh, oh, it's not like the Nord Capital. It's, I know this, but I can't think of it. Hello, Bundunk. I'm g actually going to. I'm gonna hire you. There we go. You're hired. He normally uses crossbows, so I'm gonna try and find the best crossbow I can get for him. I'm gonna stick him in my archer line. He's kind of, if you're gonna have some with a crossbow, they're kind of useless as how I use the watch, because I basically use the watch as like a meat shield and sacrificial lamb. Siege crossbow. I'll buy it for him. I've got, it's not like I'm hurting on money. Ooh, 25, that'd be 25 as well. The war bow is, oh, the masterwork nomad bow is, uh, Nomad bow is normally weaker than the war bow, but it's equal since it's masterwork. Well, I don't believe... That's a whole lot faster. I mean, I would need another power draw level to use it, but I just hit my mic stand with my toe. I need to stop doing that. <laughs> uh, is there anything else here that's actually worthwhile? A rusty sword for... Wow, that's a lot of money for a rusty sword. And yet the cudgel is that, that small amount. I knew I kept the steel bolts for a reason. Armor. Eh. I need to get people... I need to gear people up a bit better, because some of my watch is pretty poorly equipped. But nonetheless, that's kind of a... Uh, I'm going to save even more frequently. I didn't... The one time I didn't save... Sargoth! That's what I was thinking of. Anyway, the one time I don't save after I leave something important... Oh, something funny about armor. It makes strange scrolls and dirt modern to himself. Well, Clethy, he's not... He isn't a sorcerer. And I can't take you seriously with that helmet. <laughs> I just can't. Oh. Don't don't kill him. I kind of need him because he's going to make things a lot easier when we go to attack towns and stuff. Especially in the day comes where we destroy Sargoth. We have 100 people in my party. Oh, yeah, that's right. I need to uh, put Bundunk in the, the archer line. I'm still going to keep him up with my hero class because he's still, you know, he's one of the more capable ones of them. The crossbows are incredibly strong. He's going to, I think, be the only crossman I have. I don't really care, Marnet. I'm just going to skip everything you have to say. There we go. I'm gonna save before I go into the town again, because apparently the game's liable to crash when you're in the town. I mean, uh, uh, it doesn't appear that I have a die works here, so I'm going to buy a die works if they let me. They don't always. We in the guild. Okay, there we go. From velvet. That's the price I wanted. Yes, here's money for the land. A thousand per week. Let's go to the marketplace see if they have anything better here. Arms. Another siege crossbow. That's eh. I will never use a siege crossbow. You can't use them on horseback, so they're kind of pointless in my mind. I do a lot of my archery on for a horse. Ooh, a heavy maul. Ooh, that's cool. It's heavy. <laughs> that's for certain. I mean, there, it's called that for a reason. I think I might do a playthrough at some day where I... Ooh, what? Rodkins. I have a large bag of bodkins. I think I might do a playthrough someday where all I do really is use a staff. Oh, the Nords own Kura now. Wow, I didn't expect them to take that. I'll be honest. The only time I've ever seen him take that in the few playthroughs I've done of this game, well, the few times I, I've never actually, the Sultanates are at war against the Car ooh, that's not going to go well for them. It's not going to go well at all. But, the, uh, and the Sultanates declared war, that's bizarre. 
I mean, I think they declared war last time, too. So apparently this is just the, the game of bizarreness. But I remember, uh, I've never seen, at any time I've played this, the Nords take Kura by themselves. I've aligned with the Nords and completely taken all the territory before. Like, my other profile, I think the only thing we don't own is maybe Yalen or Yelka. One of the two. I'm so close to the end of it. It's I haven't played it since I started this series, and I, I probably will continue not to play it. And I forgot to save before I went into the town. As I will always do from this point forward, because I don't want to lose, say, I, if that had happened about at the end of the episode, I would have been screwed, because I would have lost a lot of content off that. Ooh, a lance. That's a regular lance. A heavy lance? Hmm. Heavy lance. What? That has no statistical differences. Aside from, it is, what? It's short, it's, okay, it's not as fast, understandable, but it's somehow longer Reach of 190, a reach of 180. That, that I just don't understand that. 50, 54. Ooh, uh, gauntlets. I want to get more of the completely closed-faced ones, but that's going to take a bit to be able to get all of those. Horse Merchant, uh, mine's 44 and 36. That's 41 32. Nope. Goods. Uh, well, there's tools there. How's my bread? My bread? Ooh, well, I'm, eh, I can get more bread. Cabbages. Cabbages are fine. Fruit is perfectly fine. Smoked fish is actually running kind of low. I've been meaning to get more sm No, I don't want to sell it. I want to move it. God. No. That's the- uh, You know what? Screw it. I'm not going to- I'm not going to complain about that. All right. Oh, I already have a dye works here in Wercheg. So I think I'm just going to check- Well, that means all the Nordic cities I have, I have one in. So I'm actually going to check Kira and see if I can get one there. And, and how much it goes for. And that'll be the end of the episode. Because, I mean, kind of a- I'll be honest, the game crashing and having to spend the time to recover that kind of threw a wrench from what I wanted to do. Mostly I was going to go around and see if there are any tournaments I could go in and basically just crush some bandits up this way and try and level some people up. And apparently try and fuel the river. But that didn't exactly work so I had to spend another 15 minutes going through that uh, the tournament again. Oh, there's another, okay, another tournament here, save. We'll do this tournament and that'll be the end of the episode. Place a bet yourself, 500, go fight. I think they're mostly archers here. Yeah, mostly archers. Well, at least I'll be using archery, which I'm okay with. Oh, well, apparently I missed that. Apparently I'm not okay with this. Hello. Really, a headshot and you're still on the horse. Okay, let's see if I can actually hit them from over here. Oh, I can hit them from over here. Fantastic. I will save you, teammate. Hopefully I won't actually hit you with my own arrow. That would suck. Okay, that hit the horse. If someone comes up behind me, I'm in a bit of trouble. Uh, someone's shooting at me. Oh, hi, guy. You can't do anything about this. You can't do a dang thing. Apparently, somehow, block an arrow that was behind you. But that's okay by me. Oh, great. You know what? Just... There we go. What? How strong is it? Who is this guy? He was Kratos. Okay, God, that makes a lot more sense. Kratos is, like, impossibly resistant to things. I mean, he took a, a headshot and two other arrows, and he didn't fall. Great shot, mercenary swordsman. You should be a... Oh, you're a regular fighter. Good <laughs> good shot, regular fighter. There's no lords in this, so... Oh, Artimoner is in this fight. Fantastic. I got to kill him. I don't like him. I'll be honest. I only have him in my party because he's useful. Let's actually take out... Green! Because <laughs> they're all charging us, and that's not good. Okay, optimally, let's actually take the horses out first. Oh, look, Red is almost already dead. Great. I will take out everyone I can. And I say great as sarcasm because I'm on Red. Oh, no, wait. Red is almost completely dead. I will save you, my friend. Or I'll just break the horse and then crush into a wall and break my skull open. But that works. That works all right, too. Don't pick on him. Oh. Well, that was effective. I meant to... Meant to stab him and missed entirely. Oh, well. <laughs> I'll pick on the regular fighter. You guys can't. He's mine. <laughs> can I... I wonder if I can hunt him. Just chase him down. Daggers on horseback are almost completely useless, by the way. That you're going to do almost no good trying to fight someone you're on horseback if you have a dagger. So you might as well just get off the horse and go hide in a wall. <laughs> Even though I basically took out two entire teams by myself on this one. And if that doesn't say testament how much easier this game is on horseback, I don't really know what does. Because if I was doing this on foot, I would. if we were all on foot, we would have lost this. This round would have been over because I would have lost. Oh, he's got throwing weapons. Okay. Hey, right, can I get you? 
Okay, well, I can get your shield at least. There we go. If we were all on foot, we would have lost that. Because that just would have been overwhelming me. Oh, great. Throwing weapons. Ick. Is that going to hit anyone? No, I think I might have actually hit a fan with that one. Yep. Yeah, I, I am not good with throwing weapons in this game. My skill is incredibly low at it. I don't remember my keybind to turn it off. Uh, no, okay. Is that it? I found it! Oh, I don't even know what I hit. I think I hit X. Yeah, I hit X. Okay, get away from my, get away from Artimeter! Okay, or I'll just stab at you and miss. Or I'll keep stabbing at you and keep on missing. Okay, this will work eventually. You'll fall down soon enough. Delivering zero damage. Yeah, maybe you won't. Can I... Okay, well, I did some more damage there than I did before. See, the thing is, you get that close to him, your horse just freaks out because you're too close to a person. There we go. God, I'm so salty. <laughs> and that, uh... Blocked my attack while it wasn't even looking at me. 180... Uh, 87%. Because of speed boost. Yay. Okay. I'm going to choke him off at the rock. I missed. Of all the times to miss, back up horse. I missed that shot. Well, not shot. I missed that stab. And again, he blocked it from behind. <sighs> this It's this kind of stuff in games that makes me really salty. I'll be honest. Especially that, considering... The texture <laughs> that would have hit them. That would have hit them. Let's actually go back to throwing mode. There we go. Because this seems to be working a little bit better. Although not really. This isn't working at all, actually. Okay, I hit the horse at least. Ugh. This is the saltiest tournament I've ever participated in. Okay, that missed. That got him. Didn't really do any... How did that deal three damage? Only three damage? It's a javelin! They get stuck in shields! And yet it deals three damage when it hits a person. That's 19 when it hits a horse. A horse is made out of flesh. Granted, it's a different kind of flesh, but that should be irrelevant. It still hit flesh. I mean, I know it didn't hit him in the head or anything, but I wasn't aiming for the head. I'm just aiming for them. <laughs> and I'm missing... Oh, my... Ugh. Okay, 15 damage to your horse. I'll get, I'll get you eventually. Okay, 15 damage to your horse. Uh, turn, 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 turn. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna die now. Okay. I need to see if I can find a dead body or something and grab a sword. Oh, equip the sword. Equip it. Yes, okay. We stand a chance now. It's, much, it's still not a big ch chance, especially if the horse freaks out like that whenever... You try and attack someone, but there's still a chance. <laughs> We've got this. Yeah. Okay, that was 45 damage. It's more damage than we ever did with the uh, the stick, the pointy stick. Okay, I'm not gonna chase him into that wall. So not with him right behind me like that. Okay, okay. Apparently blocking wasn't gonna do anything there, but we still have the little saving grace thing, I believe. Okay, or I'm eliminated from the tournament somehow because that's how the game wants to work that. All right, well, Mouse War Cleaver. That's the same thing I have, actually. Ooh, Master Work Saber. Temper Two-Handed Saber. I kind of want the... I want to, at some point, play with one-handed weapons. Just because I think that'd be... An, I, it'd be fun. Ooh, plate armor. I want to get my entire hero class coat of plates at some point if I can, but that's really expensive right now, and I can't really be affording that. Because I need to build up my supply for when I start off my, my own little empire. Guildmaster and meet... Wish to buy land. All right, velvet from silk and dye. One grand. There you go. All right, and that's going to be the end of this episode. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. Next time, we're probably just going to kill off bandits for a bit. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you next time.